back. Welcome back, everybody, to the New Mexico DLC. We are down in Roswell, but right now I really wanted to take a quick look, and I haven't shown off this lately because uh, I had to get rid of a bunch of mods, and I'm slowly putting things back. We got the, the Mayflower, the RD moving van. We've got a satellite image map. Real company box trailers. That's why we're seeing a bunch of those around town. Coca-Cola truck skin. Haven't seen that yet. NASA fuel tanker. And the Freightliner FLB edited by Harvin. That's the one that we were driving around for a while. Uh, but we're not driving that now. Anyway, just wanted to bring you guys in here. Show you all the uh, the mods here. Oops. Oops. Clicking on the wrong things. I'm just going to use my mouse to get through this. Changes are good. Uh, yes, I want to exit the mod manager. And we're going to get right back into it. Continuing the game here. Monte Rico Gaming TV. See if we can hit level 20 as well. Yes, Christmas event results. We didn't win, we know. But good to be back, driving along the track. I've got some exciting news, American Truck Simulator news. We'll be talking about that a little bit later on in the episode, but right now we're just going to take a look-see at the world map. Yeah, we're in Carlsbad. We want to head up around towards uh, Roswell up here. What is this guy? Oh, we don't want that number three there. Yeah, number one, number two. So we're going to follow our little waypoints here, explore a little bit of this 529, and uh, head up north. And see if we can catch ourselves a job to get us going up to Raton there. And that's going to be the final town. Actually, it's the final city of everything so far. And yes, that's that, that satellite map. Gives it more of a realistic uh, background look. Looks interesting. So I don't know. I do agree. It'd be cool to get a heavy load we're going to have to, even if we do get some mission to take us up this way, up 25, we're going to have to do an exploration on 64. It just looks way too fun. Uh, so let's get right to it. Let's hit that drive button. And yes, we are free as the wind. Get a little bonus XP driving around doing that. So it's not a total loss to drive around like that. And imagine that, it's raining. The good news is... We're gonna go the wrong way. Yeah, that's not the good news. The good news is that sun is coming up and not going down. Alright, well, we'll be nice. And we'll at least exit this properly. Come on now. What is this little restaurant shopping center? Man, I could go for some bacon and eggs right now. That'd be some... That'd be some good times. It's a little bit closer to breakfast than it is to dinner time. How oh, however, whoa, let's get inside. Uh, however, I can't say no to breakfast for dinner. All right, that's, uh, let's just roll through that yellow. We cannot safely stop. Like I care about the road rules while I'm playing this game you guys saw last episode. No, I don't run every red light. Sometimes I follow the rules here, but uh, some episodes we just got to get to where we're getting to. Which this is like one of those, but we got a red light, so we got a green light. I said we got a red light, so we get a green light. Nope, obviously. See, man, I can't even see the, uh, the light. Someone must have a turning arrow or something. There we go. Hey, Mr. Policeman. We just moving right along. No complaints my way. Not today, my friend, not today. So, this doesn't look totally new, but it is. Totally is, totally is. Driving into the sun. Hope you guys brought your uh, shades with you today. Uh, the sun's going up quick. We get a look at the, the beautiful Ray's as we pass Ray's Hamburger Shop. How do you like them? How do you like them burgers? Mm-hmm. Dem patties. What is this? What is this? Look at that. Look at that road. Look at that road. What is that road? You sure go far that way for not really being on the map. Do not enter. No, we're going this way. We like to explore. Hey, truck. You gonna stop? Yeah, you're gonna stop. One way. Doesn't look very one way, but where is this going? Oh, I see. This is just taking us back up and around to the, uh, what is that, Plaster in Sons? Dang it, dang it. Well, we'll go take a look-see, right? This is 
the whole point we're trying to explore not just the towns, but a lot of the little locations in New Mexico. Get through it. Get through it. Nice. This is going to provide us a whole flip around up here. I can dig it. That was an interesting dirt path. And I will be showing off that secret dirt path. There is a secret road that is its own achievement in the game as well. How far can we pull into here? How far can we work it? Ooh, can we spin it all the way around here? American Motel, open. That looked more like a trailer park. Wi-Fi, it's clean and welcoming. Oh man, we barely made that. All right, my turn. My turn. So says the eagle. All right, we're up on out of here. <coughs> Getting more chatty. Chatty on. I know I've been dropping some other videos of uh, a little side achievement for Transport Fever I've been working on. Time lapse and throwing down some music, and I haven't been talking. But you know what? <coughs> In reality, that uh, achievement, I wasn't even going to record it, so it's just bonus. Bonus stuff, and trying to show some different content, but we're back to it. Come on, man. Come on, man. Hunky on. We're, uh, we're trying to drive here, trying to get somewhere. I know the speed limit is not 20. Uh, and I get that it's not you, but it's the person in front of you, but still. Push them a little bit. Uh, let's see. I'm going to take a little look around, because this is safe while we're driving. And yeah, things are looking good. Do we have oh we got to put our oh hey. Whoa, we're not on the road. Hey, hey. Windshield wipers on, Kaz, of course. We love the rain. Here. Wow, for not really wanting Oh look at that guy, couldn't even handle this little white car anymore. This guy's got no moves. He's not gonna go for it ever. And then he's got the ambulance. We're gonna get a little sneaky here. We're gonna get a little sneaky here. We're gonna get a little sneaky here. Come on now, come on now. All right. No. Nope. Right after this truck, we're going. Getting a little sneaky here. Sorry, white car. Oh, look, he's still going. Oh, oh, look at that. All of a sudden, he grew, grew, and uh, went for it. Yeah. Now he's gonna be in front of me. Fantastical times. Fantastical. Uh, let's finally get up on out of Carlsbad. We'll take the change in pavement in uh, that being the case and get on past these people. That's right. They're making me want to drive a little bit more aggressive than we started. Silly little white car. Next next thing you know that's going to happen is the... Uh, what do you call it? Look at me. Still using my flashers. Uh, they're going to be calling the... Uh, the little station wagon is going to be tracking me down. It's always spying on us. I went back and watched a uh, one of my original American Truck Simulator videos from way back in the day. Earlier access of it. And the station wagon was watching. It's always watching. It's always somewhere. If not in front, it is behind us. Because uh, I, know, I know directions and such. Like forwards and backwards. Yes. Yes, I know, police officer, you're not really going to do anything about this. Because you're on your donut run. Alright, we're going to take a left here. Because now this is going off into... Uh, quick, before everyone gets here. Everyone stop, because I couldn't make the turn. My bad. My bad. This is New Mexico Road 529. We're not in the UK. Get on the right side. Not the wrong side. And we're going to get our truck on all the way up north. All right, we are about to hit waypoint one. It's about dang time. And it's showing an ETA. That's what's interesting, though, is you drop down the waypoints and it gives you ETAs. So that is pretty fancy. An hour 29 until we get to our final stop. So I would say for how I drive, about 10 minutes at most. We are going 91. And I just didn't get a ticket from that guy. Wow! 97. I just watched my crash video uh, crashing 
going uh, 94 miles per hour, but we're top on 100 right now. But we're gonna have to break, 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 and just go for it. Yeah, looking to the right is for losers. No, just kidding. Look to the right. And some wonderful oil derricks chugging away. Boy, it is stinky. Whew. Lived by some of those for quite a while. You get used to it. You get used to it. it numbs your brain eventually. No, just kidding. But do. Whew. It stinks. All right, here we go. Moving right along. Ooh, 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 ooh. That's kind of a thing. I know. I don't know if you guys keep up with the the blogs, the SCS blogs of the game. Hey, look, that's our first look at the uh, the May. Oh no, that wasn't. It was like an AutoZone truck. That was the Mayflower one. Uh, but on the blogs of this game, finally they did announce where they've been teasing pictures, but they announced where they're going next. And uh, it's like it's like the gaming gods are with us. Uh, they're visiting my home. They're, 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 hey, it's the wagon. They're coming my way. No, that's right. If uh, I was to read you the rule book of the state that's coming out, which is in most states, you can't be crossing in double yellows. Uh, yes. Oregon's on the way, everybody. Yes, that's right. Oregon is on the way. The good old beaver state. That's right. The way of the beaver. The way of the ducks. The ducks versus the beavers. And, uh, boy, we cut ourselves right up there, didn't we? Good work, boys. Good work. Good work. Oh, man, especially you, sir. You were doing an amazing job supervising. Just, you might as well just get in the car and drink your coffee. I mean, really. I mean, wow, this deserves an external view. This is quite, uh, I would be guessing oil refinery since we just passed all of that. And, uh, I do believe this is where the zombies are. Just, uh, just throwing that out there. Just throwing that out there. And you know what? While we're here, it is worth taking a look at the job market. Uh, from where we're going and uh, seeing where we can go. We want to stay in... Wow. Not, New not Nevada. Are these in order by price? Let's do by destination. Clovis, Clovis, gotta get ourselves up to Clovis. Uh, Gallup, no. And uh, then it goes to Arizona, Phoenix, Phoenix, Prim, Raton. I saw it. I saw it. We're gonna go rail export, and we're gonna. Should we haul some pipe? We could haul uh, uh, a Schneider. We could haul. Ooh. A double, double trouble of cheese. Oh, I thought that was almost the hot dog. I is they do they have the Oscar Mayer Wiener vehicle? I want to drive it. Uh, no, we're gonna get Bushel Farms two whole things of cheese. Ooh, yeah, and we're gonna be heading up twenty five for that business right there. Ooh, yeah. Let's see if my truck can handle this. Can it handle the cheese? The cheese is the madness here. All right, no rules until we get the cheese. Really? Do the rules not apply to me today? I was going 100 past a cop, and uh, I was going through that red light. Maybe it's because I was in such the wrong lane. It just didn't even know. Bushnell Farms. This is the... Uh, the famous cheese farm of New Mexico, if you guys didn't know. New Mexico is famous for its cheese. It's the... Okay, the station wagon is watching because it's it knows I'm telling nothing but lies. No, we are not in Wisconsin, everybody. We're in New Mexico. And uh, we are on a race with the train to deliver the cheese. The train thinks he's got his ways under control. Yo, Mr. Ricardo, look at the ABC Supply uh, Racing. Didn't you help me uh, out with that mod? And I, again, I keep talking about it. If you still need the files for that mod, apparently I have them. That's uh, not 
modded through Steam. I don't, I don't remember what I did on that. Back in the day, and it's just stayed. Haven't seen it available for a pickup, which is quite nice. Quite nice. Let's get back inside. And really, guys, we live in the desert here. L wait. The rain is for Oregon. Now watch. We're Oregon DLC is going to come out, and we're going to get no rain. Now that is going to be the big difference. This is Oregon is just amazing. Uh, and since they do know that it is just larger uh, than the UK, and ATS does have Europe Truck Simulator, I'm hoping they're going to get the sizing done right. And the, the difficult thing with Oregon is that it's got just so much uh, biodiversity. Is that the right word we're going there? So many biomes of... It's got the deserts going strong. It's got the... Uh, on the east... It's got Crater Lake, which is the deepest lake in in the United States. And uh, I think Russia has the deepest lake in the world. I'm not too sure. And uh, what else we got going on? Hopefully no trains anytime soon, because we got this double trouble going over the track. And taking a right. But yeah, I hope they really focus on a big transportation hub for... Uh, Oregon is Highway 84 right up on the gorge uh, in between Oregon and Washington. And the gorge is just fantastic. And they've, they've shown that they can do some pretty cool effects in this game with uh, going through some cool rock features and such. So the gorge should be quite easy. I don't know if they could pull in details such as like a uh, Multnomah Falls. Uh, really cool, famous waterfall. Just beautiful, beautiful, beautiful stuff. And uh, once we start discovering the actual Oregon DLC, once it comes out, that's when I'll start throwing up pictures on the screen of it and what I'm talking about. I like it. The wagon is always watching. Uh, but Oregon, I'll know a little bit more about. I live there, so good times. I've driven through everywhere we've been so far. Nevada, I'm a little dry on. Really? Another train already? We'll just act like that's the guy we're racing. What is... Is that thunder? I was like, what is... My truck sounds hungry. It sounded like a stomach growling. Tacos. Speaking of stomach growling. Mm. Man, this is a long haul. 318 miles. Five hours to go. 40 minutes. Uh, I'm going to be pushing the speed limits because uh, we're going to have some fun in the sand. So as the name is the of that hotel. Uh, oh, you see that tipped over car in that uh, riverbed? That was pretty intense. Man, when in New Mexico, you just don't you don't want to ask certain questions. Apparently, don't want to ask. And now I do think, if my memory serves me correctly, uh, this is going to bring us north through Roswell again. Just finally finished up making all the little thumbnails with the alien picture. I thought that was pretty cool threw that up on all the DLC for American Truck Simulator, but the sad news is is this episode right here is almost the finale. Yeah, this guy's getting close to the finale, uh, because we're visiting the final city. All I've got to do is hit up all the rest stops for an achievement, which is kind of a, eh, I probably will. I might catch that one and record it, or I might get lucky I'll put a shadow play on. And, uh, yeah, because, you know, that's what they made plans of with Shadowplay on NVIDIA. They were like, you know what? Someone's going to want to really capture the last five minutes of their epic truck driving. No, I think it was more meant for, like, Overwatch moments and first-person shooters and epic moments like that. But you know what? In my mind, sometimes the last five minutes of American Truck Simulator is the most epic gaming experience that has been had, and it must be Shadowplayed. On that note, we've made it to Roswell, and the rain does seem to be lighting up. And living in Oregon today, I gotta say, it's uh, February, and it's the first day I've seen the sun in a long time. And what am I doing? Inside playing American Truck Simulator. Not for very long, I'm gonna go out, get up out in the wilderness of Oregon. I just love it, it's amazing. Hey, check this joint out. Fantastic, hold on, we gotta throw down a, uh, we gotta get up on out of the car. As we know how to do here, and we get into photo mode. And uh, check this place out. UFO Gallery International Art Center. 
See what I'm talking about? There's just depth, man. There's depth. It's like I could go in there, go grab some snacks, go buy some uh, UFO, uh, what, are, what are those little gift cards, postcards, even better. See, I can read all this, kind of. That's a little blurry. Museum and Research Center, open seven days a week, 9 a.m. till close. The UFO Gallery. The Electro Store, 24-7, non-stop, open, mini-mart. Ice cold. Bujanade. What the? Okay. This, that's not me. That's me. There we are. Hey. 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 I know you. Do that. A little capture screenshot, a little selfie while we're driving. How about that? All right, back to the... Back... Whoa, there's a car in front of me. Food Services of America. You see these guys crawling around. Definitely. No jokes on that. All right. You know what? We're going to stay outside for the rest of uh, Roswell. Give, give it a nice little change of pace. Checking out iFlop. Oh, we're stuck in this one. Give me the ticket. Duke, duke, duke. I was already out there. I was already in it. This is definitely... Uh, Old school downtown, uh, the south, lots of, uh, just big, wide avenues. Rock from the sun, Roswell, alien spacecraft, question mark. Come to the alien zone. It's the American way. Alright, there's my Roswell advertisements. Need some computer alignment, clutch engine, and electrical works? Stop on by to American Appliances and Auto Repair. Because, you know, you want the guy working on your washer and dryer also being the guy who works on your car. Which, actually, I mean, if you're a handyman, then you're handy with stuff, and you might as well. Alright, let's get back inside. We're rambling. Rambling, rambling, rambling. Hmm. See my reflection in the mirror. The beautiful American truck. What's up, school bus? What's up, school bus? Oh my goodness! Now the stupid song stuck in my head. I've been uh, watching the the reboot all the way on, just because you know you got to. Oh, there was a car there. Um, oops, there's a car there as well. In the station wagon. Uh, uh pff, magic school bus, yo. It's back. Now my daughter's been back into it, and uh, you know, sometimes you gotta watch something besides mind numbingness cartoons so I thought hey girl check this out the magic school bus you'll learn about things and stuff and it's it's actually quite quite uh, informative quite informative uh, but anyway back to it why did I, why was I thinking about that ah oh, that's right a school bus God. school bus space Roswell flying donuts it, it, it is what it is Ooh, look at that castle it's like a Medieval times. You guys got a medieval times in Roswell? What do you guys got here? Is that the high school? What? Hold on. It had a sign. Now I gotta go look. Ah, you guys. Sorry. We're, we're definitely off track today. It says the Pearson Auditorium. Pearson Auditorium. Let me fix the blur. There we go. Take a screenshot of that. That's cool looking, man. They've been getting some really good... I guess that, that would be included or called a localization, right? You know, they're finding little details. And it's not like you're seeing that in every town. But you're seeing certain things in certain areas. You're not seeing all this UFO stuff in all the towns in New Mexico. Just Roswell. So definitely some love and some care uh, to each little town here. I'm definitely enjoying that and I am so glad... To be seeing some highway up ahead. Oh, oh, ha, 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 truck headquarters. Truck headquarters. Hold on, hold on. We're going to get crazy here. We're going to detach <laughs> our trailer in the middle, in the middle of the road. And we're going to, yeah, and we're going to crash into a wall. 9% damage. I got way too excited. Hold on, there was, there was a truck headquarters in, uh, in Roswell. Yes. Enter. Yes, we want to buy it. Come on now. 
180k. We're gonna upgrade this bad boy too. We got places to be. Go, 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 go. Wait for it, car. Oh, that was a good one. That was a good one. I'm sorry, but I can't hang out here. I've got I've got cheese to deliver, man. It, it's I mean it's refrigerated kind of, but you got to get got to get going. We still got a four hour haul. Oh, that's not gonna cut right. Get it? Cutting them cheese. Oh, come on now. Let's get back in and get out of here before we get in even more trouble. They can't complain. We just bought some serious real estate from them. Oh, crazies. Leaving Roswell. Probably for the better. A little bit for the worse, but that is awesome, folks. We got it. I remember last episode, I got all disappointed. Hmm, this is a pretty looking intersection. I'm looking for these junctions and such for uh, City Skylines. Been working back on that again. And, uh, oof, almost, almost recorded that, but I was really excited to talk about Oregon DLC on the way. We don't, I have no idea when. I'm sure this year. And, uh, oh, interstate performance. Refrigerated, interstate refrigerated. I'm going to get on over for you, bud. This car can wait. Uh, yeah. But we're just getting so close to finishing up this series. And, um, if you know me, I kind of have, like, 500 series going at once at all times. And finishing one up is kind of a, it's kind of a thing. It's kind of a thing. Hey, David, Steve W. just leveled up. Congratulations. The, uh, the little... Uh, congratulatory plaque is in the mail. I like to uh, treat my employees right. You're also going to get a $5 gift card to the UFO Museum in Roswell. Uh, yes, I know you, he lives in California, but whatever. Someday he might have to truck himself a load out here. Lazy Steve W. Leveling up, thinking he's all that and some more. Hmm, level 20's on our uh, radar. What is up with this speed limit 55? Speaking of acting like we're in California, speed limit 55 in New Mexico? This is unacceptable. Uh, I distracted myself. Don't know what I was talking about. I keep forgetting that uh, I leave that GPS on. I got my own GPS there, and this looks much better. Ah, look at that efficiency. One cup holder. One cup holder for me. That's all we need. It'd be cool if I could, like, press the little buttons and roll up and down my windows. I'd like a little bit more of the buttons working. That's what I would like to see as well. Um, for how awesome and epic this game is, uh, some focus deeper in on the, uh, the actual trucks, because they're doing an amazing job with all these new environments. Hey! Ups. Ups, ups, ups. And I'm just trying to think. Oh, you know what I'm going to be trying out? <clears throat> Not going to be recording it, but I did, I did get my replacement in just yesterday for my Oculus VR headset and American Truck Simulator. I don't know if you guys knew this or not. You can play this game in virtual reality, and it is it's quite nice. I still prefer playing it to standard because it's still not as crisp and clear but the ability to look around with the VR headset and have a full just wherever you look you can see everything around you kind of like this but you know me now I'm seeing everything in my office uh, it is really 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 quite quite fun quite interesting so if you do have a VR headset and you didn't catch it uh, I think it's just like any game where you right click on it go to the properties and uh, how you can put things in like experimental uh, I think there's an option for uh, VR, for Oculus, or something like that. It's I don't know if it's totally officially done and done, uh, but it is there. Oh, we got a way station in a mile. Please pull in for vehicle inspection. I was just going to ask. I wonder if they're going to make a stop, and the answer is yes. And unfortunately, it's the same way station that we've seen before. Remember pulling straight across here last time? That's quite interesting. Can't believe we got to pull left up here to go to this way station. This has got to be a thing. Because this is different than any kind of way station I've seen. Hey, bud, what's up? Yep, we're coming. 
Enter. Yep, 71k. That sounds about right. It's where we're usually at. I gotta hit the achievement. There's some heavy load. Actually, you know what? For Holland, too. I would have figured more. This is some light cheese. Cheese light. In case you're on a diet. Uh, there's an achievement for having a really heavy load and hitting up one of these way stations. So, I figured I would just get lucky with that someday. Ooh, almost crashed. Man, I gotta get straight across here, and I do not get a light, so I'm just gonna go for it. That car's gonna hit me, hit me, hit me, hit me, hit me. Nope, it's gonna stop. Smart. Smarty smart. Now, I almost do wish this GPS did have a little bit more details, like... The, uh... This one. This one, I like that ETA at the bottom. That's usually why I kind of keep this one going on up. Uh, I like being able to see the time, keeping an eye on the notifications of what my other drivers are doing. But I don't like how it covers up all those gauges and stuff. But I mean, I get it. It's it's where it is. I just, uh, I'd, I'd like to remember to try to keep that off a little bit more. So I'm going to do it right now as I'm talking about it. And driving around all over the road. Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. I was really hoping I'm going to get some more time and uh, dive into another game today uh, after this recording. Or I might double trouble an American Truck Simulator game. Yep, give me my speeding ticket. No. Wow, the cops are uh, taking the day off. Uh, yeah, ooh, look at that old style church. Almost like a the one in Seven Days to Die. It looks a little old and creepy, but it looks still like it's in service. little town right there. Uh, yeah, 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 the rambles. The rambles without complete sentences, those are good times. And then I forget what the first part of the sentence was, and then you might get the second part of the sentence. Sometimes you gotta wait until next episode to find out what I was rambling about. Should we just finish off this uh, station wagon right here and now? We're just gonna just crush them right into the Mayflower. Yep, no, I see you brake checking me. Come on now. Come on now, none of that. Oh, we do have a left turn up here, and we are hitting up Santa Rosa. Santa Rosa, it's so beautiful and it's still raining here. Uh, yeah, I remember last time we started talking about the rain a little bit. That's what kind of got me starting to talk about... Oops, I went way too far out there. Uh, that's what got me talking about uh, Oregon, and, and we can see rain when we get there. <clears throat> but then that's what made me think about how Eastern Oregon's really not all that bad as far as rain. And I don't think Oregon's as bad as Washington. Washington State all the way up in the northwest with Seattle. Whoo! And I, I gotta be honest, I'm surprised because, uh, not to hate on Washington, but there's not much. Like, the e uh, West Washington's real nice. But the uh, eastern bit is desert and, uh, I mean, pretty much like Oregon, too. Not all that fancy, but kind of similar to Oregon. To where I figured they could pull off a uh, northwestern pack and uh, bring us Oregon and Washington in one. But uh, the announcement was just Oregon. Now, this is a pretty cool uh, interchange here, as I almost don't pull off that turn. Hadn't been up here yet, so we're switching on to what highway 50, or we're getting on to 24. I could look at a map. I could. Well, I'm just gonna get all the way over because that wood guy. He's not uh, yielding for cheese. Not today. Not today. We are on highway 40, Interstate 40. So this guy definitely keeps on keeping on out of New Mexico, heading on north. But we are actually now going to head north on 84. Which is funny as I was talking about 84 earlier for Oregon. But the Oregon 84 I'm talking about is the East-West Interstate 84. Since this is just a state highway, it can have an 84, I guess, going north and south. But for interstates, that's not how they work. But we covered that before. I don't remember. Maybe you guys remember. When did we cover that? Episode 2 of New Mexico? Maybe even all the way back in episode 1. Maybe you binge watchers remember. We were chatting a little bit about the weird interstate rules of the United States. Odd numbers, even numbers. Pi. 
Hmm. Pi. Hmm. 65. See, the speed limit on this road 65. Come on now. Come on now. This is the final bit of, uh, bit of honey right here, though. That's what we're calling this. I think we've got about two hours left on the drive. So I think that's, uh, what it's going to have me do is that real nice uh, squiggle road up north. And maybe finding the uh, hidden road could be its own episode. Those are my thoughts. What are your thoughts? It doesn't even have to be about American Truck Simulator. Just, uh, what are your thoughts? I need thoughts, man. I need thoughts for these uh, trails of tribulation. Oh, man, I've been playing some Darkest Dungeon. Durandy's been playing that on his, cha uh, on his channel and uh, got me loading that back up. They did an update for a new Radiant uh, campaign. It's like an easy level, but by calling it easy, it's not really easy. What it does is it tries to cut the game time down in half. So that's quite interesting, if you guys didn't know about that update. Uh, what else is new? I'm still waiting for that RimWorld to hit 1.0. It seems pretty much finished up. And uh, getting into some other things. Sim Airport just came out with multi-floor support. It is epic. It is awesome. And boy, people are funny on the forums. I'm not even going to go into it. I'm just saying. I created a discussion about a bug and people just start going off on what's realistic. And Oh my goodness. Games are games, people. Not everything has to be 100% realistic. Now, simulators. That's a little bit different. Kind of. I still think it's good to have really... Your goal of a simulator should be hardcore realism, yet realize it's still on a gaming system, basically. And uh, having games available to play for everybody while maintaining the ability to go epic realism, I think is pretty cool. And I think SCS is doing a pretty good job on that. And uh, another company... Wow, that felt like an explosion of sunlight. Uh, another company that uh, I've been playing... You've, you've been seeing it on my channel, like some Train Sim World and stuff like that. Flight Sim World. They are constant... It's a station wagon. It's passing me when i got to change lanes. Um, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stuff and things. Things and stuff. Ramble, ramble, ramble. Oh yeah, you hear that? That's the the wake me up strips on the side of the road. That are our trucks feeling a little gassy today. It's okay. It's okay. Happens. It it happens. It's the eagle. The eagle's having a bad day. There's a good rest stop and uh, that we didn't hit up going the other direction. Oh, and we're gonna have our rest stop in one mile. And those are, if you remember, one of the achievements is to hit all these. So while we're here, we're not going to stop. I think we're still good on rest. But we are going to drive through this kind of like a madman. Because that's the kind of madman we are while we play our American Truck Simulator. Full speed. Truck stop 7 of 22. As you can tell, I've got some work to do. Thank you for not noticing I'm barreling down the road. And you're probably going to just stop up here. Oh, yeah. What? What? Little red car. And white car. My bad. You were a innocent bystander of the madness that was the exit on ramping. The merging of madness. Okie dokie. What do we got here? Um, Cuervo Silver? What? Sounds like a tequila. Alright, let's hit up F3 here. Let's see what we got left. 52 minutes on the struggles. I'm going to get my uh, windshields a blast and 
And uh, we do have the cops kind of rolling on up. We've been called in quite a few times. And uh, we gotta blend in. Alright, that's not blending in, but it's having some fun. You gotta have some fun when you got truckloads of cheese. What else are you gonna do? What is with the flashing of the lights? The lightning is no joke. Come on. Come on, man. We don't like this no joking in the joking lands. Come on, honk honk. Honky honk honk. This is gonna take forever. Hey, look. Another of the same billboards. Because that's interesting. Someone's got that market. That billboard market. Farmington. That's weird. That hits close to home. Uh, alright. Oh, no. I thought we were going to exit here. I was mistaken. So mistaken that I don't know. Ha, 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 speed limits. We're going 45 and a 75, people. I know. You live in the desert and you don't really know what rain is, but... Come on. Come on. All right, can't handle it. 27 minutes or not, we're passing. We're passing hard. Oh, see? That right there could be... No. I wonder if that's included an exit. The gas station, way station. Hmm. Hmm. I can't believe we only have 7 of 22 of those. That is a hard achievement. You gotta really be cruising, because the roads I'm achieving and unlocking the other side by driving here. But I'm not going so far as to unlock... Here we go, next two exits, the final town. Not so far as to unlock the uh, rest stop on the other side yet. We are going to have to exit here. First exit is ours. Vraton. Ooh, we have an incident. Right before... Oh, what a bad place to break down, buddy. Did I say I wanted to drive buses? Not if they don't know how to repair those suckers. Going to get up on out of here. Raton exit 450. Seems like we could have gone up to the next exit and also hit up the town. It looks like we might have to go to the next exit to... Ooh, I love these little flip-arounds. I see these in New York a lot. Haven't seen them in the game so much. Um, yeah, are we going to actually unlock the town of Raton here? Yes, I think we are. I think we are. Looking good to me. Do not enter. Okay, I'll go this way. Very unique style build up. And there we go. Achievement unlocked. The land of enchantment. Enchantment? Enchantment. Enchantment? You guys know? Enchantment. Oh, you guys should know. Oh, oh, horrible. How are we going to pull this off? Missed my exit. Missed my turn. Yeah, this was totally intentional. We're gonna do a big flip. Flip. Oh, didn't see that red car. Can we pull it off? Can we pull it off? Oh, I can pull off anything. Sorry, posted. Sorry, fire truck. Sorry, Mr. Truck. Oh, wait. You're turning where I need to go. Uh, it's not good for you, bud. Look at that. Ring around the rose. Yeah, I, I just danced around him. All right, folks. Look at all these stupid nicks and knacks on the sidewalk, keeping me from driving on it. Oh, great. Now we got cars coming on in, right when I'm trying to get work on. We're working here. Working here. Oh, look, and it probably would want me to do a big old flip back, so we're just going to drop this off. Call it a day. It's been a long episode. And there we have it, my friends. The land of enchantment has been enchantment by Monty. Some old Dragon Age origins. Stupid little enchantment guy. So it's enchantment, enchantment. Anytime you walk by him, enchantment. You want, you know, he was a special kid. You guys remember? I think there was a mission to save him. I can't remember his name. Anyway, totally distracted here. Monte Rico Gaming TV. I'm out, everybody. Good gaming to you, and uh, maybe we'll hit level 20 next time. Taking a good look at our map here, and uh, yeah, we got to go explore this 64 because that's gonna be awesome. And uh, we're going to have to go find the hidden road. It is somewhere in here. Somewhere. 
somewhere, somewhere. Uh, and some, you know, 491 needs to be driven, 70 needs to be driven. Little section of 25 down south. But I really did enjoy uh, this, which is odd, something odd to enjoy. But well done on this little final intersection. Great way to end it. A uh, lot of stuff going on with all... Look at all this coastal mining up here. Might have to take a look-see at that as well. But y thank you guys all for joining so far. And we are almost at the end of our adventure for checking out the downloadable content that is New Mexico. So as we've already said, peace out and good gaming. See you next time.